We beat to rap what key beat to lock, but I'm cool like that. You're now rocking with the best Luminary Sounds, the, the number one station for independent artists. I'm cool like that. I'm cool. Yes, yes. Uh, we are back in the building with an amazing guest. She's Let's not go. new. She's been here before. That's right. But she hasn't been here for today. Today's going to be really special. We That's are right. here with Raquel Bianca. Woo! Oh, hey. I got it right, Missy. I got it right. I didn't mess up nobody's name. Favorite. I didn't mess up nobody's name. There yes, we one go. One of the favorites. So, uh, obviously, she's an 805 star. Yes. No. We all know. Oh, no. Yes, she is. She's a star. She and is. With, uh, uh, and so humble. Always yeah, so and humble so humble. With, with Trendy Eats, 805 Night Market. You've seen her do the delicious food tasting. and They can let us know what food trucks are good and which ones we don't really like. Yeah, are, will you, will you well, ever we say that? No, I was going to say, you guys don't those. do that. Well, I think talk. everybody has the potential Come to on. be better. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> like, why? I'm not going to put them on the spot. I'm just <laughs> like, playing. Why shut them down? Yeah. I don't know. know. I don't know. Let me but, tell like, the Like, maybe they just haven't found, like, Their the group. thing. Yeah, okay, like, okay. All right. You know? I, yeah. But I know Raquel and, and Javi, of course, can let us know which ones are very good and which ones yes. we should check you, you out. You have a top five? For sure. Right now, I like they cycle through. In all honesty, they cycle through. Okay. But let me tell you, right now, I've really been digging Gourmet District. Not just because mm. he's Ooh. like parked really close, like by, and I'm just like, shout out it's to like Gourmet a 10 District. Minute drive, right anywhere else, and I'm like, oh, if I go right here, Gourmet it's District, so good. Yeah, it's like those noodles. You're a... full, right? You're full, and you're like, I, I gotta stop eating, but you keep eating. And you're like, I'm still full. <laughs> Why am I still eating? So what did they what have? What, did, go, go, what are go, some go. of the items I they have? It's like Asian fusion. Oh, nice. I always get nice. like the garlic noodles with like chicken. Yeah, mm-hmm. he'll go for the steak, but have you go for the steak? Yum! It is okay. so good. I okay. always get that nice. sauce. Okay, sure. okay. So that's one. Do we have a number two? It'll be at eight oh five nine. Well, it depends. It depends. It depends, depends. depends. It depends. It depends. 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 It depends. on the mood, right? Yeah. Depends on the mood for sure. Go. I'm a big fan of Gordos. Gordos, yeah. Oh Gordos. Gordos. Love Gordos. Bomb. I love Gordos. I gotta Gordos. get their hat too. I'm gonna have to check out this. this you gotta pop um, open the honey packet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sandwich. Absolutely, absolutely, absolutely. The whole experience. Mm-hmm. Yeah. The whole experience. It's mm-hmm. a pleasure to have you here. You guys have Thank grown you so, much for having us. so much. Oh, yeah. right? Yeah. What has the transition been from the first 805 night market to like right now? What have you learned? Oh, my God. Yeah, there I is want, so I, much that I we want have to hear. learned. I wanna hear this. <laughs> okay, so in the beginning, We went in trying to just create this really awesome event for like everybody to just enjoy. You know, we had been to LA and you know, we've seen so many food events like that. Mm -hmm. And we're like, well, we don't have anything like that here. And there's such a good foodie culture here. Like this would be great. So we're like, okay, so how do we start planning this? And you know, we got together, we saw the documentary, the Disney documentary. Have you guys seen that? Like Imagineers about how Disneyland like got started. Have to see that. And oh, no, I, not. I have not. So we were watching it at like four in the morning and we're like, this is it. Like we gotta do an event, <laughs> something like this, yeah. where it's like people go and it's like the Disneyland of food. Wow, okay. And I, I mean, like obviously that. it's not there yet. Yeah. But like that's like the overall goal. I mean, how cool would it be to that, go somewhere? He was we definitely an inspiring man. Yes. Definitely. So that's cool. We're like, okay, we'll do the food event. And we started planning it. And there's just so much that goes into it, honestly. You really do need, like, a full force team to mm-hmm. really make this happen. Yeah. And so, thankfully, you know, the response that we got in the very first event was way more than we could have ever anticipated. And we're so grateful because it just shows how much, if the community comes together, like, what can really happen. I remember you guys were, like, exceeding the number by thousands of yes. you, what <laughs> wow. expected. How many did you have? There was like, well, the police officer that was there, you know, just kind of like helping, you know, oversee everything said there was like at least like 20,000, 23,000 people. And we were like, (laughs) we did not plan for that. We're like, okay, maybe, you know, 5,000. If we hit 10,000, that's going to be great. But we were not expecting double that. Yeah. And you guys, as far as where you sell your tickets, you're like the number one, right? In this whole Ventura County or Los Angeles area, right? Uh, I think in Ventura County, I don't think we would mm. top LA because there's just so many people out in LA. And I mean, a lot of people came From out to Ventura Bright. County. Event mm-hmm. Bright. Mm-hmm. Javi would actually have those stats. Yeah, I think the 805, yeah. Yeah, okay. Yeah. I think you got to wow. be, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I know when we try to get with uh, Event Bright, I know this is kind of segueing. You know, we had to go through like just, you know, the protocols. But then, because of you guys, you guys have a customer service person you can talk to. And <laughs> it's like, man. We got to get to that level. It's like that's yeah. this big time for you guys to reach that many people. Well, what do you what do you think it was that had so many people come out? Was it COVID or just the you know the event of having so many food? I think uh, it was definitely a there. combination. Like, okay. I mm-hmm. think people were 
home so long it was kind of like something that they could go and enjoy with their family mm. you know they could it was a family oriented event there was good food they, there was music there was entertainment a lot of people came out to support all these cool kids that were dancing mm. definitely I did not have those moves when I was a kid I was doing like one of these <laughs> like the sprinkler I, I still the like Q-tips and throw that away that kind of thing I still don't have those moves like, like I wish I did kids, today man they kill it on stage like sometimes yeah. like my daughter for example she'll do like her TikToks in the living room. Oh, so cute. And I'm like, okay, I'll do one with you. Yeah. And I'm like, okay, this, I mean, it looks easy. And I'm over here, like, all out of sync. And she's like, so sharp. And it's her first time she does a dance. And I'm just like, you guys got to be born with uh, they it. They built for it. They built, built yeah. for it. For uh, sure. That's one thing I really enjoy how you guys incorporated the children because they have such mm -hmm. a good time. And like Javi said, you know, it builds them confidence. Yes. And, you know, there's like like not a prize there. It's just like everybody just uh, bragging rights. Right, right, exactly. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. That's a lot of fun. And so being able to kind of see all of that come together with the kids, I think that's really what drew in, you know, a lot of attendance. You mm. know, the food. You know, where are you gonna go where you can find so many different varieties of food in one place? Where are you gonna go where you get to see your kids? You know, kill it on stage. Where are you yeah, gonna go true. where you can shop all these really cool, you know, pop up shops and boutiques and. You know, it's just the pop up shops and boutiques are my favorite part yeah. of it all. Actually, I'll go around and I'll I like I'm like, oh, I'm going to get this. I'm going to get this. <laughs> oh, I'm going to come around back around and get this. Yeah, <laughs> that's my favorite part. Actually, the food is a very close second. I know it's probably people's number one because my number one. But who, for sure, who can like, say no to food. Do you, how much I have to ask you is because in all of your still shots, you're like eating the food. Do you eat? The whole meal? Are you just no, are you no just way. tasting and you're moving on? I I, I've eat. always wanted to know. <laughs> <laughs> I eat what I can eat, right. and then like that's that. I mean, I gotta have some limits. Imagine I eat the whole plate, and I would not fit through this story, <laughs> you know. And I gotta be able to move around to carry like my little kids. Like I got yeah. two under two, mm -hmm. so I'm like one over here, one over there. Yeah. And oh, I wish I could just sit and eat burgers all day. But. You, are you a burger fan? <laughs> I'm burgers. a huge oh. burger fan, and I've burgers. never really met a burger fan. I mean, do you put the oh. egg on a burger? Sometimes. Oh, but you have done it. But though. I have done okay, it. Okay, Because right, I'm see, not a fan of, like, runny eggs all the time. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. Like, they got to be like that. Yeah. Runny in the middle, kind of like jello. Have you guys ever had that? Yes. I, it's still, like, I have. soft, but yeah. it's not, like, squishy. Yes, yes. Yeah. Yeah. Can't totally. do the squishy. That yeah. is. That's that's the best. That's, that's the, best. the best. Okay, so but what's the next? Slice of heaven. <laughs> yes. What's right next there. for the eight oh five night market? Like what's your next event? So our next event is actually March eighteenth and nineteenth, which is an event that we're actually really excited about because, okay. you know, we really take all the feedback that everybody gives us, you know, from the first event, like you said, there were some like rough patches because of the attendance that was not anticipated. Mm -hmm. And we've tried to like, you know, improve as the events have gone by. Yeah. So mm -hmm. we're actually going to have it for the very first time at the Ventura County Fairgrounds. And hey, so we're really all right. Yay. That's, that's what, dope. What's, what's Yay, the name of the name of the event? 805 Night Market. It's 805 Night Market. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. There we go. 805 okay. Night Market. What's the change? What's the big changes? Can you, so, can you tell? The big change is, is we're going to actually have more than 40 food vendors this time. It's the first time that we're going to have like a lot more than that. Oh, wow. Um, okay. We're going to have over 30 uh, craft vendors. And then we're actually, we were trying to do it in the last few events, but we weren't able to really get it set in stone. And this time we're actually going to have um, beer at the event. So you guys oh, can like drink your wow. beer, you know, grab okay, a Okay, Missy, let's go. Let's do this. <laughs> have a burger. Let's do this. <laughs> you let's know, go. It's very fun. Walk around and enjoy. Still family oriented, <laughs> yeah. you know, but just also. King IPA over here. Are you ain't lying. The adults and the beer goers. Let's go. Yeah. I like that. And so it's really exciting. Is no. it a free event or? How it is, is a up? free event. Okay. Um, okay. I think the dance show is the only thing that's going to be charged, but that's separate. Um, that's mm. to be able to kind of put up the production and everything. Mm. You know, there's going to be over 300 dancers, which is insane. Oh, wow. 300 so dancers? 300 oh, wow. dancers. That's there's... all these kids just packed with talent. So you're Girl, seeing actually, a concert, like a little yeah, baby. This is, yeah. Like wow. I keep saying, it's kids, but it's not just kids. You know, they actually have you know kids and they have adults it's just a yeah. big variety of dancers which is really cool all the dance companies do you use the same dance companies or like have you gotten like outside people like from la or from the north being like hey i heard about your night market can i perform so Good we question. do get um a lot of inquiries and we actually haven't incorporated a lot of those inquiries yet because mm -hmm. for right now we have um the dance show company kind of organize and they pull in collaborators oh, okay. and they kind of set up like their whole 
dance show. Uh, Byron actually right. mm-hmm. puts all that right. together with um, his partner and his team and, and so on. And he never misses. Like, every, it hits every time. <laughs> it hits No, he doesn't time. miss. Yeah. Yeah. And I've seen them when they practice. Like, they're just so strict. Even, like, the kids. Like, they're just so into it. They're, like, on it all the time. I, I love watching them, though. Yeah. I mean, oh, come yeah. on. You can't help it. The kids, come on. Everybody love the kids. Junior love the kids. <laughs> Junior love the kids. <laughs> love the kids. I think we all love the kids. Yeah, we all yeah. love the kids. We all love the kids. No, and one thing that you, you know, just you mentioned, it just, even if you're not a food fan, just if you like different pop-up shops, there's mm. something for everyone. That's one thing I love about what you all are doing, and I think that's just so great because there's going to be something for everybody. So you have a reason to just come out and just show love, you know, exactly. because there's something out there for you. I, I got a question about the vendors. Uh, are you guys, you know, dealing with difficulties of vendors trying to get in and they can't because you're packed? Uh, or what, what's that, that situation mm, like? Cut off time? And yeah. Unfortunately, it is something that we do come across because we get so many inquiries. I think the mm-hmm. day that we put up the application, I think we got... 250 like submissions and it, in you know, a day in a day it was in a day it was maybe like a couple of days but, but even still then, it's overwhelming you know and so trying to sift through and still trying to keep it you know where we can still have you know local vendors but also bring in vendors from outside so that mm-hmm. the local community could also try things that aren't here right um trying to really make it something where it's fair and still give other people opportunities while still keeping you know the favorites that people really want to see right there it's definitely difficult to go through mm, mm, mm. i think that's maybe we'll put it up to a vote where we can have you know everybody kind of vote for we should just do a rock paper scissors you have 200 really vendors there. and try to we see can what pull happens, in yeah. like a new one every time or something yeah yeah i think yeah. it's such a compliment that so many vendors day of or a couple of days of apply because that just shows what a success you guys are I agree. Mm-hmm. it really feels nice to know that there's that yeah. kind of support mm-hmm. not so much for us but the fact that they want to come together to work together to make this event possible for everyone to enjoy yeah one of my friends uh, has a food truck and he was there at the 805 knot market the first one and he said it was just the biggest payday he's ever had <laughs> since he's had a food truck <laughs> and he's like i miss those days yeah. <laughs> so it's like yeah. you know I don't know when you're gonna get twenty thousand people to show up. Um, do yes. you think the the amount of people that showed up the first time compared to right now, you think it's equivalent to the same, or do you think there will be a drop off? Um, I think it's hit the same. I think every event varies. It kind of just depends, you know, on like the weather, on yeah. what other activities are going on. But even then, I think it's pretty close to the first one. Okay. Yeah. Two and days. Now it's two days. Two days. So then. It was everybody showing up one day All versus one. like now it's kind of split into That's two. That's good too. That's good. Yeah, so that's good. It's, it's good. Well, it you makes know, it easier. We're gonna be there. Yeah, we're gonna be there. there. We're gonna show up. We're I gonna be going. there. Saturday oh, and okay. Sunday. Yeah, Saturday and Sunday. Come we hungry, go. guys. Oh, uh, yeah. I, I, oh, I do. Let's go, to, Missy. Let's go. We gonna tear yeah. it up. You don't have to tell <laughs> me twice. Come hungry, we'll all eat together and we'll all cheers. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. absolutely. Yeah. So. Well, we're gonna have you here for a while because we have a lot of games we're gonna get into. Um, and Javi, I don't want you to get jealous about some stuff going on. Okay, we got you know just 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 hang <laughs> tight. Games. We'll be right back. The games. I thought it break.